Hello. We are excited that the summer is coming to an end and we are about to begin our 2020-2021 school year. We shared a re-entry plan a couple of weeks ago with you and would like now to go over some of the main highlights from that document and also talk about some important upcoming dates um, for you to pay attention to and hopefully for you to participate in. So we have now um, coming up later this week on August 27th, the middle school is going to host a meet and greet. Please look for a text or email invitation for that. On August 31st, Hector Alvarez and I will be doing a, a new parent guardian Zoom orientation and Q&A for all families who are new to GBCS in grades K to eight. September 3rd or 4th, you will be invited for a kindergarten meet and greet, hopefully in person. Look for a text or email about that. And September 3rd or 4th, you will be scheduled for technology and material pickup um, here at GBCS. So everyone will have staggered times to come and pick up their devices. Kindergarten and first grade students will have iPads and second through eighth grade students will have Chromebooks. Here are some highlights from our reentry plan. We are starting with the full distance learning model, which means that students will be working remotely from home and we will be connecting with you um, through primarily Zoom. Um, GBCS educators have identified elements of effective distance learning um, and are now building off of what we learned this past spring to improve our model. We've learned a lot since March. The expectation and rigor of classes and assignments will reflect a traditional GBCS school program. The daily agenda for K-8 distance learning in all grades may include Zoom mini lessons, student-centered learning, small group discussions, Zoom partner work, projects, and independent work. Assignments will be given that will need to be completed online and offline, live and on demand, and while also working to strike a balance between screen time and book paper manipulative time. Distance learning will include mandatory live instruction Monday through Friday, following a regular school day schedule, early dismissal from 8 to 1.35. Students are expected to log into classes in order for instruction and learning to continue. Expectations will vary based on grade level but the intention is to stay connected. Um, there will be times where teachers will ask students to do tasks not on the computer, but then coming back and joining back in with the group um, periodically. The schedule. Once again, eight o'clock, a hard start time. Please make sure your child is logged in and ready to start at eight, and they will stay logged in until 1.35. There is a 30 minute lunch break built in as well. Students are expected to be logged in and ready to learn at 8. Phone calls will go out around 8.05 for students who are absent and tardy. So please make sure they're on and ready to go and not missing anything. Grab and go meals for the week may be picked up on Wednesdays. Um, our special schedule is listed here. Um, so you can see, depending on the grade level, what time students have their specials. So sixth grade has theirs at 8.15, K-1 at 8.50, middle school 9.25, second and third grade at 9.20, sorry, 10.05, and uh, fourth and fifth grade at 10.45. Um, we have another possibility for K-1 at 11.25, but it looks like we're gonna go with the 8.50, but we'll let you know for sure. Um, I also have a sample schedule here, so you can see an outline of what a day would look like. You can see that the instructional blocks are 55 minutes with 15 minute recesses in between. We know that kids need to take a break from the screens, need to take a break from their work, so we have those peppered in throughout the day. Um, after lunch, we have our flex intervention and enrichment block. We have non-target language blocks. Once again, this will look a little bit different um, depending on grade level. So we are starting off with phase 1A, 8 a.m. start, 135 dismissal. We're going to be following the schedule from September through December. We will reassess in December 
to determine if we can meet the health and safety requirements to begin phase 1B, which is a hybrid schedule, starting off with one day a week in person after winter break in January. Once we then go to phase 1B, then next following that would be phase two, which is two days a week in person. Parents, guardians, support at home, um, we continue to look for the fantastic partnership we have with you. Um, please make sure that children are practicing um, good hygiene at home. Please make sure you're doing uh, frequent temperature checks. That is something you'll be expected to do as well when we come back to in-person learning in the building. Um, make sure you're aware of how to protect yourself and others. Um, just being mindful, this is a global pandemic. It can be very stressful and traumatic. Um, if you or your children need support, um, we're happy to help with that. Just let us know. Please also be mindful that the academic program in September will be more rigorous than it was in the spring. Please speak with your children about setting up expectations and routines to help their success finding a spot, figuring out an alarm system, just making sure that they get back into the groove. Um, we are also going to be offering family learning nights, again, through Zoom. Um, we will have topics related to distance learning, social emotional care. We'll also have fun topics, things that you guys will just find engaging, things that we've done in the past, and some new topics as well. Um, so please uh, look out for those topics. Just want to thank you so much for all that you're doing for the overall well-being of your children and your family and their education. We are incredibly grateful to work with you and continue this collaboration. Um, we couldn't do this without the partnerships that we have, so thank you very much. And once again, the upcoming dates, um, please mark those on your calendar. You will get alerts through text or email. 20, August 27th, the middle school Zoom meet and greet, August 31st, new parent guardian orientation, September 3rd or 4th will be kindergarten meet and greet, September 3rd or 4th will be technology device and material pickup, and September 8th is the first day of school. We look forward to connecting with you all very soon. Thank you.